Ethan Slater has filed for divorce amidst his relationship with Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande has found her personal life in the spotlight as a result of her new romance with Wicked co-star Ethan Slater. After news broke that the Thank You Next singer ended her relationship with her husband of two years, Dalton Gomez, reports soon surfaced that she was romantically linked to her Wicked cast member. While fans took to social media to share their thoughts on the unlikely celebrity pairing, focus also shifted towards Slater's now estranged wife, Lily J. On 17 July, TMZ reported that the Nickelodeon alum and her real estate broker husband has been separated since January and were heading toward divorce. The news came just days after Granny was spotted without her wedding ring at the 2023 Wimbledon Tennis Championships. The two reportedly tried to reconcile their marriage a few months back but have been having problems since before Grande began filming the movie musical adaptation of Wicked in London. One source told People that Grande and Gomez have been quietly and lovingly working on their friendship since their separation. They came to the decision together. They were having problems before January, but they want to remain best friends. Another source told Page Six, They've been really good friends throughout the entire process, and their friends and families have been trying to protect them. Grady and Gomez began dating in January 2020 and announced their engagement 11 months later. They were married during an intimate ceremony at Grande's home in Montecito, California in May 2021. Singer linked to Wicked co-star Ethan Slater. Three days after it was announced that the Seven Ring singer and Gomez were separated, a report from People confirmed that Grande, 30, was in a relationship with Broadway alum Ethan Slater, 31. Ariana and Dalton separated in January, a source told to outlet on 20 July. She and Ethan recently began dating, and he is separated from his wife. Another source shared with Entertainment Tonight, Ariana and Ethan recently started dating. They have a lot in common and have a lot of fun. They didn't start dating until both were broken up with their significant others. Ariana, Ariana and Dalton remain friends. The two reportedly started dating while filming John M. Chu's movie musical adaptation of Wicked in London. Grande stars as Glinda in the upcoming film. Initially scheduled for release in November 2024, while Slater will play Boak, who becomes the love interest of Elphaba's sister, Nessaros, after his affections are thwarted by Glinda. Ethan Slater and wife Lily J separate after 10 years together. According to People, the Broadway actor separated from his wife Lily J before his relationship with Granny began. The former couple, who were reportedly high school sweethearts, married in 2018 and had a son in August 2022. However, it appeared that Slater's wife was completely blindsided by reports that the co-stars are now dating. It's horrible. They were high school sweethearts. They have a baby. She's a wreck, a source told Page Six. Sources also speculated that Slater's romance with Grande is the reason he and Jay suddenly break up now when nothing appeared wrong between them. Meanwhile, TMZ claimed that Jay is devastated her family's been torn apart, and she's also upset that their young son won't have both his mom and dad around constantly, now that the couple have split. The sources added that the parents aren't on good terms, and noted that the Break Free singer used to hang out with both Slater and Jay when they were still together. Slater shares Instagram tribute to Jay in May. Following reports that Slater and Jay were separated prior to his relationship with Grande, many fans pointed out that Grande had previously liked two of Slater's posts dedicated to his wife. In one Instagram post, which was shared on Mother's Day last May, Slater posted a faceless photo of their infant son's ears. Happy first Mother's Day to the most loving, caring, and wonderful mom slash person in the world. He captioned this post in honor of Jay. In November 2022, he celebrated their four-year wedding anniversary and 10 years of being a couple in another Instagram post. My best friend, four years married, 10 years together. And this is easily the best and most bizarre, yet he captioned a slideshow of himself and Jay over the years. Slater has since made his Instagram account private, a move that some followers claimed confirmed that then-rumored romance between him and Grande. Slater files divorce. On 26 July, Slater filed for divorce from Jay after four years of marriage. According to TMZ, the actor filed the court documents in New York City on Wednesday. A source told the outlet, 
It's understandable that emotions are high and it's hard seeing your ex move on, especially in such a public way. And Jay's friends are trying to protect her. But Ari and Ethan are just trying to lay low and be respectful of their exes as they pursue this new relationship. Grande and Slater are full-on dating. Following reports that Slater filed for divorce from Jay on 26 July, a source confirmed to people that the new couple are full-on dating and Grande really likes Slater. The 34 plus 35 singer reportedly sparked up a friendship with Slater on set of their upcoming film, Wicked. It was obvious on the set from early on. They were very sweet to each other and often seen laughing together, the source said. However, it appeared that cast and crew assumed the two were just friends, considering Slater was still married at the time. Everyone just thought they were both happily married though and didn't expect them to end up dating. They said, Lily J breaks her silence. In an interview with Page Six published on 27 July, Lily J broke her silence on reports that Slater and Grande are full-on dating and referred to the pop star as not a girl's girl. Ariana's The Story Really, Not a Girl's Girl, Jay told the outlet. My family is just collateral damage. Now, Jay said she's focused on raising her and Slater's son and being a good mom. The story is her and Dalton. The musician added, referencing Grande's split from her husband, Dalton Gomez, after two years of marriage. However, sources told Page Six that Jay has been calling every news outlet to get this story out, but acting differently towards Slater behind the scenes, while another reported that Slater is trying to take the high road and hopes that he can resolve this situation for the sake of their child. Grande is giving Slater space as he works things out with estranged wife. Grande is reportedly giving Slater space to sort the details of his ongoing divorce. According to TMZ, the Wicked co-stars haven't seen each other for several weeks, as is later as is later traveled to New York where he filed for divorce. The SpongeBob SquarePants of it all. Amid the relationship drama, many fans couldn't help but point out Slater's claim to fame before he was cast in the Wicked movie musical adaptation, starring in the SpongeBob SquarePants musical on Broadway. In 2016, Slater was cast in the lead role of SpongeBob SquarePants during the show's original Chicago production. The musical later was relocated to Broadway at the Palace Theater in New York from 2017 to 2018. For his performance, Slater earned a Tony Award nomination for Best Actor in a Musical. As news broke out about Grandy's romance with Slater, the wife of Tom Kenny, the voice actor of SpongeBob SquarePants, chimed in to clarify that the interview singer wasn't dating the Nickelodeon star. Jill Tolley, who's been married to Kenny since 1996, clarified that her husband is not the one dating Grande in the comment section of the Cut Instagram post, which asked, Is Ariana Grande dating Spongebob now? Tolly wrote, Hi everyone, I'm married to Tom Kenny, who voices Spongebob on the TV show. He's not dating Ariana Grande, she said. While Tolly added that she doesn't know if Slater is dating Grande, she thought that they're totally adorable and totally ships the actor together. She concluded her comment, which appeared to have been deleted, by celebrating a relationship milestone with Kenny, who's been the voice of cartoon character SpongeBob SquarePants for more than two decades. Just wanted to set the record straight, Polly wrote. P.S. As for me and Tom Kenny, we are celebrating our 27th wedding anniversary today. Meanwhile, Slater's former SpongeBob SquarePants cast member described his new relationship with Grande as unexpected. I was surprised, Lily Cooper who played Sandy Cheeks in the musical, told Page Six. I haven't spoken to him in a while. It's an interesting coupling, for sure, unexpected. Neither Ariana Grande nor Ethan Slater have commented on the reports surrounding the relationship. The God is a Woman singer was previously engaged to Saturday Night Live alum Pete Davidson prior to her relationship with Gomez. However, Grande and Davidson called off their engagement in October 2018 after just five months together. She also dated Mac Miller from 2016 to 2018. The late rapper died in September that year from an accidental overdose at age 26.